We knew that he was different, and I just wanted to save him. Hi, Sunny. I'm Sarah, and this is Sunny's Story for GeoBeats. I went to Tractor Supply, and that's when I saw Sunny over in a corner by himself. He had a little poof on his head, and I just could not leave the store without him. And we had a whole flock of ducks at that time. Ducklings normally group together and huddle together, but they would always leave Sonny out, and he would always be in a corner by himself. He didn't grow at all for two weeks. Then we started noticing that he was sounding wheezy and his eye was watering. We took him to the vet and found out he had an upper respiratory infection. But he had to be on oral antibiotics for two weeks. Finally, he started growing like the other ducks. The crest on his head is actually a genetic mutation. We spent a lot of special time with him. Okay, Gary, that's enough. I would tuck him in my shirt and let him take naps and just take him everywhere with me. Later, we found out he is completely blind in his left eye. He would run into things. He would swim in circles. Good job. Where are you going, Sunny? You would reach for another duck to pick him up. They would run, but he wouldn't really see you coming. Either that or he didn't mind being picked up. He does have some sight in his right eye, so that's why he always tilts his head to be able to see. Our animals, I think they all know that Sunny's special. What are you two doing? Sunny sleeping? <laughs> they let him eat their food. They can tell that he's not a threat and they just kind of let him do his thing. He gets along with all of them really well. You can't get to your water, Sunny. There's a cat in the way. <laughs> there you go. I named him Sunny because he is just a little ray of sunshine to everyone who meets him. He is mostly indoors in the morning when we come down and we say, good morning, Sonny, he hears us, he starts doing circles. It's very cute if we have him out of his pen, he'll walk around and when he bumps into me, he'll find my hand or my leg and he'll rest his head on it and just go to sleep. He does get to go outdoor, but only when he's supervised. He just doesn't seem to be comfortable around ducks. They're not very nice to you, are they? Yeah. Hey, you know what is right? He likes people. He goes with us on vacation. Ooh, The vet confirmed that he 100% would not be alive today if he wasn't getting the special care that he receives. A lot of times when we're out in public, people don't think he's real. We took him to a trunk or tree one year and the kids were coming by and so many of them would come and then he'd blink and they'd say, oh, is he real? I thought he was a stuffed animal. Our bond is really special. He definitely has a special bond with my husband as well. And he likes our kids too. We have six and eight year old children and they're very good with him. He knows his name. When we say Sunny, he tries to look for where we might be. Come on, Sunny. We hadn't heard him make hardly any sounds until we started giving him baby toys in his pen. And he just went to town on those things. He just loves to play with his toys, and anytime he's playing, he's making his playing sound. And it turns out we live 20 minutes away from each other. We joked, let's get him together for a blind date. 
after they had their first date at the farmer's market. And they walked around together, but missing each other and making a circle around. What makes him different makes him special. Where are you going, Jenny? He's taught us so much just by being who he is. Oh. You need help finding the pond? Yay! It doesn't matter how hard life gets, he is always spreading sunshine. Sunny.